What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Thought I'd do a quick recap of uh, my top pulls in March and April. Uh, do top 10. These aren't necessarily in like fiscal order. They're just kind of my favorite cards and things that I think are going to either be worth a lot in the future or just because I like them in general. Uh, we've got some fire, also a couple of honorable mentions. Stick around. Let's see the top 10 pulls. Yeah. All right, let's get into it. We'll start with some honorable mention. So these didn't make the top 10. Still thought. So we'll start off with one of uh, the Yankees' top prospects. I think actually the number one prospect. Uh, this is a uh, Jason Dominguez on card auto to 50. Rookie card. He's going to be really big. Stay tuned because uh, they're part of... Uh, One of them makes the top 10 list. Let's go with card two on the honorable mentions. Big fan of this guy, Christopher Morrell. Uh, this is on card, uh, rookie card. Um, game warm patch, uh, three out of 10 on the Christopher Morrell. Also a really big fan of his too. So that was really cool to get. Honorable mentions list. And then last one for the honorable mentions. Uh, I thought this was really, really cool. This is a uh, booklet, uh, Joe Burrow rookie card. Um, and this is to 49. Uh, Joe Burrow rookie. These are not game worn, uh, but the patch is pretty sick. So that is uh, honorable uh, mentions. Let's get into it. Here's the number 10 card that I got last month. Pat Tillman, M10, Color Blast. Uh, Pat Tillman, obviously, American hero, right? Super cool to have his Color Blast, I thought. Um, such a pretty card, Gen Mint 10. Uh, Pat Tillman coming in with your number 10 spot. There. All right. Card uh, number nine. How about a little red cracked, red ice? Turbo Turbo rookie card, M10, monster, pretty sweet card here, coming in at card number nine. All right, card number eight, another color blast, little lamb jack action, M10, color blast, Lamar Jackson, not his rookie card, um, you know, Monster, monster. That is card number eight. Coming in at seven. I actually got this card off eBay. Very, very low price, and his numbers have skyrocketed. Fortunately, he got an injury in the playoffs, so the Pelicans aren't looking good. Um, but here's your Zion Kaboom rookie card, Gen Mint 10. Got a steal on this one at eBay. Um, that one's actually skyrocketed. Value a little. Zion, very unfortunate injury, obviously. Um, in the playoffs there, Pelicans aren't looking too good. But still, if Zion keeps going the way he is, some people were crazy to think he was a bust. He's not a bust. I think that cut a lot of weight. Coming in at number six. This is a recent pull, actually. This is a CJ Stroud white Contra from the Obsidian series. This is super short print. I actually haven't seen one of these on eBay yet. Uh, and if I have, I'm sure the comps are pretty high. Um, these, again, are very, very short print. CJ Stroud obviously is very high in demand. Um, so that comes in for number five. The CJ Stroud white Contra. All right, number four. Anything's possible. I'm a huge Celtics fan. This is my uh, card number four. Larry Bird, Larry the Legend. It's actually a uh, sticker auto, but I thought that was cool. One of one. Larry the Legend, baby. Coming in at number four. That's actually 
five. Uh, it's been a long week. Here's here's number five. Here's number five. Oh, this was sick. This is a Joe Montana Super Bowl edition. Uh, downtown Black Pandora. It's a gym night. It's a mint nine, but that's still dope. Um, and that's two twenty five. Montana, the living legend. That is a pretty pretty cut. Move you to the back. Smidge in there. No disrespect to the legend Larry himself. Mr. Montana. Coming in there. All right. Number three for me was a three way tie. Just because of the uh, rarity of these cards. Um, I couldn't pick which one in number three, so I thought I'd throw them both in there. This is a DK Metcalf Gold Kaboom. That's the slash 10 on the 9.5. And then one of the all-time greats, Adrian Peterson. Weird to see him in the uh, Redskins Uni. That's a uh, mint. Those Kabooms are very rare. Those are sick. And the gold. Takes your number three spot. Again, couldn't decide which one. I think the Metcalf, just because it's his rookie card, um, is is obviously probably better than at the end of his career adrian peterson but still thought that was. all right number two josh allen rpa look how sick that pat josh allen rp that's number two that is just sick disgusting and it's in very, very good quality. Very, very good. A little bit of fraying on the patch. Not sure, but that is your number two card. Beautiful Josh Allen rookie card, number to five. And card number one. This may be a surprise. And this is a gamble, right? Because this is a prospect. Uh, but I very much think that... He, he is going to pan out. Here's your number one card that I pulled. And that's a Spencer Jones on card auto to 50, Jim Mint 10. People argue who's the top Yankees prospect. Is it Spencer Jones or is it Dominguez? Probably Dominguez right now, but Spencer Jones, I think, holds a lot of weight. And I think that this card one day is going to be worth a lot of money. Right now, this comps on eBay for about 3.5K, um, but this is one I'm definitely holding on to. And that is your number one card. Let me know what you guys thought. Let me know what you guys thought about the order. Did you agree with it? Did you disagree with it? Obviously, it's just like what I like, right? So, you know, if you're a football fan or a basketball fan, Probably don't agree with that one being number one, but I thought it was a pretty cool month of card pulls none the least. Uh, and I appreciate everybody out. Until the next one, y'all. Peace.